Yeah, it's probably really buggering the camera, yeah, I thought so, because it's uh, interlacing it. I, I really don't like that effect. I never like that effect. Essential to go in here. Oh, you get one there, you can do that. And that's about it, really. Yeah, I'll do that, I think. Super shot or super bomb. Yeah, we don't really need to change anything else. I can't remember what one I used to use. Probably this one. Not really sure why the graphics are being drawn like this. Yeah, this, this looks very muddy. Um, uh, the way they've picked the colours for the palette. So it's going to come out horrible on the video footage. Let's see if we can uh, do something about that. That one little Trini bowl. down a bit more. Hmm, yeah, they've chosen some odd colours. Maybe it's meant to be like just after sunset, I don't know. It is a really nice shoot em up actually. Um, so I'm surprised it's, it's not on that thing. Yeah, super weapon's quite good. I mean, you could do a 48 colour version of this game on the Amiga. So... I mean, where's the super bomb? Three bombs again. That's just a really nice shoot them up. And playing it with the uh, joystick on that thing would have been nice. Whoa, taking a piss out of it. We've got an extra life now. Super weapon time for you boy. There's no point dying when you've got your super weapons in it. Hello mate, hello dear. You come to Steve we beam me up a bit. Yeah. Crap. So the ship is sinking into a, a rift in space and time viewed from the ground looking up at the sky. <laughs> Man, I need that, those extra like, uh, multiple things, the little airplanes as a kid would say. Yeah, it's sort of a bit like Gradius and Scramble. Mind you, Gradius has got the bombs as well. Fuck it, you don't get much help. I don't think there's any cheats for this either. I think really, for every console you've got, you need to get like an action replay type per cartridge. Get the most out of your games, isn't it? Because even if you have like an EverDrive, there's not really any, um, you know, 
trained or cracked versions of the game for that effect. And we have a visitor. <laughs> it's the not camera shy at all cloudy of it. Yeah, they take quite a few shots. Comes my firepower is not really getting any better. Oh yeah, I think it's a steampunk sort of train. Now there was a film, I think it was last year actually. Oh that's it. Oh you got to get the ah uh, you got to get the uh, mechanism underneath the gun. So that's a bit of thing, right? Okay. That's a big thing, isn't it? Yeah, so it's a quality shoot them up. I hope the cats ain't moved the damn uh, water. Haven't got any more bombs. So it does go on a bit, a bit like R type. No, if you like that kind of thing. Oh, crap. Yeah, if you like shoot them up. Definitely get this. Feels a bit weird. Like being this way and I don't know. You have to do cheeky multiple hits like this. Oh crap. Well, it's flashing, so oh, we're fucked. And you don't get any more bombs just because you lose a life. But yeah, everything's done really nice. It's sort of Flash Gordon mixed with steampunk, mixed with English Country Garden. Oh, hello, mate. You as well, eh? And you too. Cool. How many cats we got in here? I think this is about as far as I got before. That is really bad, that is, that flickering effect. Nah, well, he's got more vital but much slower, look, speed low. And the missiles are not to ground, so you can't hit anything on the ground. I think that one's a way to go. Ah, this is a real bastard to see this one. I used to hate playing this level because you can't see the little shits on the floor there. Yeah, this was like, yeah, technically it was a good show off, but it's not a good idea for the gameplay. Not at all, sir. I think we're at maximum everything at the moment. So. Of course, you can't go too high or low as well. Whatever that is, you've got. Oh, right, yeah, you see. And a bit of extra speed. But how come when I get the speed up from that thing that's rotating? Yeah, another Vanguard ripoff. Just like Thunder Force 3. Oh, no, crap, crap. You lose all your weapons, of course. Uh, I, I don't know why I keep forgetting that I can uh, shoot them from both sides. It's just dodging the bullets from that way seems to be different. I don't need more speed, mate. Firepower! Yeah, it's very dark in the background, though, so the, the camera's not going to like that either. Now we haven't got any special weapons, is it? No special for you today. Crap. It's a tough game, it really is. And if 
if you've got a rubbish joy pad or it's knackered, you're in real trouble making it. This is really a joystick game, I have to say. Yeah, it's so mean with the old uh, bombs. Actually, I can, didn't I continue? Oh no, actually, it's my last one. Um, yeah, so... Graphics are really nice, the pixel art is really well done. Taking too much damage, isn't it? Get them all the way up the top, innit? Oh, crap, come on! Yeah, I'm not a fan of all these uh, hit them 10 million billion times fucking bosses bullshit. That's for the Japanese market with their bullet hell. Oh, we needed that help. So is this supposed to be like the Death Star business? From Return of the Jedi, zooming out. Down the tunnels. Not quite the same. Looks more like a Falcon than a Millennium Falcon. Shit. <laughs> I completely I haven't played this game for so long. I think uh, my my nephew had this game on his Mega Drive. I think that's where I first saw it. Oh man. It's just, you know you get them comedy sketches where they just go on too long. Uh, it is kind of like that. It's like, you know, enough already. We get the fucking joke. Stop doing the stupid wheezing noise on the floor. Well, I was pressing the button, why did it stop fucking firing? Uh, what an asshole. Yeah, so instead of giving me all these fucking power-ups with this, that and the other, uh, why don't you just make that bit shorter? Because you give me the extra health anyway. But yeah, he's really good. This, this is... Yeah, I'm reticent to say it, but this is mid to late 80s Konami arcade sort of quality for sure which is not bad for a system that first came out in uh, was it winter 1989 I can't remember crap crap I don't really get to see the graphics now because I'm concentrating on the immediate area near me with the bullets <laughs> So yeah, I'm not really a fan of this type of over-the-top, uh, you know, boss rush bullshit. It's bullshit, bruv, innit? Especially with no super weapons. I could get away with just that. So yeah, it's, it's got everything you need. If you're that kind of R-type shoot em up lover, don't go near the camera buddy, please. The footage is already horrible. <laughs> so you're gonna sit on me while I'm trying to do the boss. Right, you're not even a lap cat. I think you're doing that on purpose. I don't even know which one you are. Which cat are you? Here, look at me, mate. Oh, crap. Shit. Yeah, it's just over the top. It's like one of those uh, Eno 10 minute riffs on the fucking uh, modular synthesizer. Crap. If we continue, what happens there? Yes, I want to continue. 
That's not really a continued. I'm not having it. I need to get them actually. I don't really need the speed. The speed can fuck off. Fuck off with your speed, man. So you get hardly any fucking energy anyway. I mean, if their plan was that you build up energy by being good at this section and collecting all the extra uh, energy, yeah, it's kind of like Scramble, the end of Scramble, you know, the city. It seems to be a bit meaner with the old power ups now. We're already fucking critical. And look how little energy you get anyway trying to get them. It's not really worth it. You barely make an improvement and they're not often enough. The whole cavern should be riddled with them bastard uh, power ups, mate. Like I said, it's like one of them stupid comedy sketches like on Family Guy when he just fucking hurts his knee and he's just doing the whole, um, you know, for like a whole fucking two minutes or something and it's just not funny after ten seconds. It's the same with this shit. And not just this game, all shoot them up like this. I'm really not interested, mate. Hang on. Thank you. Thank you. And wait, I only you only get two. What a bastard! No, screw you, mate. Actually, can you uh, cause damage by doing that? No, not quite, sir. Fire the correct way, you know. Oh, did we get rid of the turrets because we had the uh, bombs? Oh, crap. Get back up here. Come on! Come on! Wait, that's just cheating that. I'll oh, put me right there in the fucking heart of the fucking. Oh yeah, I haven't watched Heart of the Sea yet. Oh crap. So you do about a level with each credit, roughly. Don't know how many lives I've got there. My camera is still recording something. Yeah, I don't need to watch all that crap. All this, all the flickery shit. Next. Always. Yeah, look, the, the graphics are just really beautiful. The pixel art is just wonderful. And with the same bloody power up. Yeah. I mean, I'm not making the uh, camera move up and down. That floating sort of uh, effect is the game engine doing it. I'm, I'm not moving the joystick at all, so... It's really good. I mean, I would have gone with slightly less saturated colours, like, you know, 90% less slight colour, slightly less saturation. <laughs> Well, I've never seen slow down there before. Couldn't tell you if that's intentional at all. It's a Victorian shoot 'em up, that's what it is. A Victorian steampunk sort of shoot 'em up. They're useful, thank you. I don't know how long I've been playing this, but it's pretty damn good for me. Crap, crap, crap. 
mini boss already. I don't like all this mini boss bullshit, mate. But you can't fault the game if you like this kind of shoot em up, you're gonna love this. I want you to go straight on eBay and search for it right now, mate. We picked up a bomb. Get in close. Come on, your mother. Oh, that did not help at all. That was my last bomb. Oh, come on, man. Just drop. Just drop to the ground, didn't it? Only get that bit, not the bloody propellers. He's off the screen. He's cheating, man. Yeah, you can only get him with this one weapon in that one place. So yeah, if the boss fights were a little bit less, no, I don't know what sh bullet hell fanatics crave, and uh, yeah, I, I think I think it would have been for the better there. But it's a really good game. Uh, technically, it's just as good as Thunder Force Three. I, I don't think you can fault the game technically. But uh, Thunder Force 3 is more gradius than uh, R-Type. Uh, is it level 3 with a ship? Or the shit as I like to call it. Oh, I'm still playing it. I mean, I'm losing like mm, probably two subscribers for every uh, uh, numbered video that I do of this. We're up to seven, so and I have lost about 15 odd subscribers now. Yeah, I'm sure it was one six five seven before I start out. Oh, crap! Pay attention, boy. What am I supposed to do there? Can I touch that? I must have touched something. Yeah, it is such a... Oh, me too. I'm um, our types uh, conjoined twin that got cut off. Cut off with cough. Yeah, this is pure our type level 3, so... Steampunk our type if that sounds like your thing, you're going to love this. R-Type not, is not on the uh, Mega Drive. He is on the Master System, but not on the Mega Drive. They never ever did it for that. Come here, me love me. Now, I'm not wasting it on this bit. Another bomb, sir. Whatever that was, I'm sure we could use it. Oh no! We just pressed the fucking bomb button, didn't it? What an asshole. Now we're fucked. See look, we just had all that bullshit and now we've got more, you know, boss bullshit as I like to call it. And I wasted my fucking bomb on this shit as well. And it's not looking very steampunk now. It's more like 1980s Flash Gordon movie actually, I would say. Yeah, I, I don't know. And you should get new bombs with every life. That's a fucking... That's a piss take, mate. Now, what the hell am I going to eat? Shall I have my mackerel fillets with uh, some oven chips and some salad? Well, I'm actually curious to see what they taste like. The quality of them, I know what mackerel fillets taste like. But, uh, 
because they're frozen, I'm hoping that, uh, you know, they've been frozen very quickly, i.e. as soon as they're on a fucking boat. Now you have to alternate. That's fucking annoying. It's like a kid's toy. I can't really do anything about this, can I? Alright, so you can go around there, isn't it? Ah, it's not replenishing my bombs, which I don't like. Oh crap, I didn't even notice I was there. Put me right on the damn thing, innit? Them yet. Yeah, this this really is uh, R-type mothership level actually. I don't think I can go up there though. I'm pretty sure I can't. Look at them little propellers holding up this huge thing. Must be made of tissue paper, innit? How am I supposed to know that that's what I'm supposed to do? And how am I supposed to get up there then? No, sir, but that is a really good shoot mark. If you like shoot marks, you should definitely investigate that one. So, what else was in the pile here? Monaco GP2. Oh, Castle of Illusion. I, pr I prefer this uh, to Sonic. Definitely. I prefer this to Sonic, mate. But not when it's blood red like that. And who said cartridges were more reliable than discs? That didn't really work, did it? If you whack it, it works. Well-known engineer's rule from the 70s, mate. Passed down to many half generations. Yeah, so this is on the uh, Mega Drive uh, bootleg 145 games in one, but uh, the sound is really distorted. the uh, headphone jack at full volume. Now I did some uh, screenshots for this for both 